Hello and welcome back to the Planet Crafter. In our last episode, we set up some bees and set up some butterflies, did the exploration of the meteor fields, and then I was crafting some things, uh, getting ready to record today, and this meteor came down, uh, all purple and bright in the sky. I don't see if it, did it brought anything with it, though, but I wanted to show it to you and I would have gotten out here faster and gotten started faster if I could have to show it still coming in because it was a little different, a little creepy, and it was just one, which was also kind of weird. But it's here. At least I think it was just one. It looked like it was just one. It exploded quite a bit, um, but... I don't see anything on the ground next to it or among it here. And I think it was all these rocks too, which is quite impressive. Um, but uh, yeah, so we can go ahead and uh, get to work. I think I crafted most everything I was intending on crafting anyway. Um, and it crafted right here. Of course it landed right here amongst the butterflies in this, uh, in this, this collection here. Um, yeah, that is creepy. I'm gonna come back out in a little bit. We need oxygen, food, and water anyway. I turned some of the honey into high quality food. I can't remember if I did that on camera or off. Uh, it consumed, or provides 90 food, which is out of 100 here, so that's gonna fill us up completely. And then we're gonna have to get some water here too. Uh, we, we got some additional butterflies as part of uh, the research we were doing the last time, the Liani and the uh, Abstrius also. So we can put those into some collectors. I haven't gathered the things for the collectors yet. I was actually just about to do that. And then we got an Azure, and we got another Impalio. So we'll go ahead and take all those. Hydration though, you don't say. Um, I have also one bee larva we're going to put out and one silkworm larva we're going to put out uh, once we have more. I built two of those things and I have Oops, I have four silk uh, here to make fabric with, and I just hadn't done it yet. So I was waiting for you guys. Uh, let's go here, here, and here. And let's research this uncommon to see if we can... Huh? Oh, not bacteria. I forgot to upgrade those into... Yeah, see, that's what happens when you get distracted by things exploding. Uh, methane and sulfur. Four of each. One, two, three, four. Sulfur is here. Gotta make those into, into uh, mutagen first. There we go. But I only have three, uh, three fertilizer because I ran out of, uh, whatchamacallit, um, algae. Let's sequence that. Uh, then let's look at the uh, bee thingy. And we also unlock the outdoor farm. Oh, maybe I won't do this. Maybe I'll wait and use the bee for this instead. Let's do that. Uh, Butterfly, we could build some more butterfly farms. Fertilizer, zeolite, and bioplastic nuggets. I have one, two, three, four butterflies currently. So let's go make f those three, f or four if we can. Uh, four of these. Uh, four of these. And zeolite. And I think I'm going to move the bees that we have closer over here to the base. Um, I did put a, an extra couple of butterflies in there. You can put two at a time, which is kind of a bummer. Although, you know, maybe we just build our tower up higher. We can only have two in here. So I have a, a Galaxie and a Liani in here. And we have a Liani that we can put out. And then we have out and about a um, an Azure. So maybe we do that. These all have different... Oh, hydration critical. These all have different uh, multipliers associated with them. The Azuri is the crappiest one, so that's the lowest priority. Uh, so is the Impalio, actually. But the uh, Abstrius, the Liani, the Galaxie, and... Uh, what's the other one we have? The pink one. Wait, did I just look at... I just looked at the pink one. That's the Liani. Okay. Water, water, water. Hydrate, hydrate, hydrate. But I think I'm going to move the bees closer because we're going to use them for their honey. Uh, so we'll put them here by the bottom of those steps there. And I think that'll be better than... I'm sorry, full. Oh, right, good. Uh, take this, please. Oh, I can't do that. I can't do that. We need to put these... Oh, there is stuff. Oh, it's Pulsar Quartzes. Oh, crap. Um... Oh, crap. I need to get these before they go away. I suspected it would be, but I they weren't laying there on the ground. At least I didn't see them laying there on the ground. Uh, let's do lots of things here. Lots of things. And let's go get those pulsar quartzes. 
before they disappear. Wait, did they just... Oh, they didn't. Okay, whew. So you can get pulsar quartzes this way as well. So crafting them should really be a afterthought slash emergency event. Um, once you have all the things you need. Um, I'm glad I brought you into this then because, yeah. Okay, so it landed here. The big chunk landed here. And there are some over here too. I guess it waited until the big chunk exploded. That's a butterfly. And Palio. Of course it had to land where the pink butterflies are. Because that's how I that's how my luck goes. But I think we might have found all the pulsar quartz fragments here from it, so that's good. All right, let's um since we emptied our inventory out anyway, let's go ahead and pick up these bee thingies. Uh, where to go? Wait a minute. Am I in the wrong one? Probably. No, that's the butterfly one. Oh, there it is. Got more honey too. Nice. Okay, pick that up. And there's one over here. Pick that up. And let's go over here and put those two up right next to the base here. Since we're going to use them for harvesting. I guess I should have held down control to play, place multiple. Come with their own, uh, their own grass here. That's fine. Uh, let's see, pulsar quartz. I guess pulsar quartz are going to need their own box now. Um, because we get, we've gotten a lot of them, and right now I'm storing them in the miscellaneous box, but as you can see, that's not going to last very long. And then uh, let's go here and grab all this stuff back. Almost all of this stuff back. Okay. Butterflies. Back to the butterflies. So we'll, uh, we'll put the butterflies with the flowers, though, because I think it just looks right to do that. Here. I mean, technically, it looks right to do the... Let's see. Ooh, the Epstriatus. Wow, those are something. Wow. If you can see those are not very well, but hopefully you can. They are amazing in Technicolor. And then we'll go here, and we can put down another one. Uh, see, we have a pink one out here already. Uh, we have a red one out here already. We need a blue one out here already. Not that it matters that much, I suppose, because we're literally just going to put all of them down until I run out of stuff. I mean, I guess I could just put them all in the same spot, too. There's nothing stopping me from doing that. And that's where I needed that zeolite. Okay. Last one will be that one. I think I'll just put it here. They don't need to be amongst the flowers, do they? Yes, they do. Uh, except that I don't have flowers. Oh, we have flowers over here. Okay, we'll put it over here with the flowers. And you can go with Liani. Another pink one. Um, I'm never going to remember all those names. I should be writing them down. Maybe I'll do that after the recording. So that we can... Um, this is what I was doing beforehand. Uh, so that I can make sure that I get all 15 species. I needed to pick up this eggplant. Uh, because I used all of what I had to make uh, fertilizer. So I needed that. Uh, mutagen. Yeah, fertilizer. I don't have any algae to make any more fertilizer though, do I? No. I think I'll have a couple and I need three. Yeah. Okay, so we're going to come back over here. We're going to take care of this guy, another silkworm. And we'll put in the uncommon with the mutagen. Start sequencing that. And then I'm just going to drop the last of the mutagen and fertilizer into here. I did grab up a common larva, but that was before I, uh, I knew I was bringing you all in right away. So yeah, that's why. Let me have all of these. Um, and then let's go over here. Grab all of these. Grab all of those. I'm gonna drop those two silkworms in here too, because we need four for the to build one of those. And let's go over here and craft a bunch of stuff. So silk, 
into fabric. That's all we got. And then some of those, and that's all we got there too. So I'm gonna put that food in, actually I'm gonna drop that bee off too. Buzz off. In there. Uh, blueprint chips, miscellaneous fabric, there it is. We'll drop all the fabric off here. And I'm gonna drop the food remnants off. Although I guess I should store these with the vegetables now that we're actually using them for something. Um, we'll just take one with us. Uh, because today's job is to, yeah, we got the farm, we got a few more tree uh, species to um, off, off whatever, um, off camera. Um, so we're getting back to the list of tree seeds we had before. I should go around and write all those down too to make sure that there aren't any new ones coming up. Uh, the ones we have planted that is. But I think let's top off our water and then we'll head out and go to the mushroom cave. And it's dark here, so that means that it sh should still be light in the mushroom cave. Um, should I take the stuff with me? Yes. Let's take three iron, two silicon, and a titanium, I believe. Three iron, two titanium, and a silicon, as well as a beacon, which is titanium, silicon, and aluminum. Okay, so. Uh, two titanium and one silicon, and then a titanium, a silicon, and an aluminum. And that should get us what we need for the, uh, um, to build a base, to build up, yeah, a base in the, um, in the mushroom caves, uh, where the red is. So let's, um, let's change this color. I don't know that I want to go all the way back to blue yet, but maybe we can go to, like, uh... I don't want to go green either. Um, what color blue are they compared to that one? Let's just let's just go with teal. That'll be fine. Um, at least that'll be a little bit different. And then we want to go here through this cave that we found the last time into the mushroom. Sorry, the mushroom uh, river. I think is what it was called actually. Mushrooms River. Yep. Uh, someone pointed out to me uh, that there are actually golden chests. Ooh. Butterfly Futura. It glows pink. Yeah. Uncommon will take you. Common, we're going to skip. Rare, we're going to take that one. So this is... I remember reading something about there being specific species that you must find in here. I'm going to take a few of those because I bet you they're nice and uh, useful. Um, but... That would be one of them, at least. So... We definitely want to pick up the rares and the uncommons still, because we still need some more bees. And some more silkworms, too. I might stop with the bees and the silkworms after I have enough to make, uh, you know, a little bit more things, like the, the, the farm, and uh, at least one farm, and at least one more silk thing. Common. I'm not sure how to systematically do this I suppose I should find a good central point that must be the uh, the crater marker so maybe we'll just come over here by this big mushroom tree I guess that's as good as any maybe right in here and put down our, our base before we forget and suffocate although again we, we should be fine with that and then we'll go here and I temp tentatively tentatively should have brought the teleporter with me um because this is what i'm working at now but i wasn't sure if this is where i wanted to have it but i think it's going to be another futura okay i mean those are going to keep spawning um so maybe i don't pick up any more than one more maybe i don't know what uh eight oh an 800 multiplier yeah never mind those are going down for sure we're going to build some more butterfly domes too for that Let's go. I've lost my lost my way. There's the red and the teal. So this this way we came in. Uh, so let's continue over here where we were. And I'm I'm less looking for grubs as more because they're gonna spawn whenever. As I am looking for unique things to this biome. Um, that's interesting. 
a bridge. Bridge to where? And as we talked about in the chat in yesterday's episode, um, these lead me, or I need to remember to continue to double back like this so that I make sure that I catch every area from all angles. Because otherwise, uh, there's easily things I could miss. Uh, we're going this way ish. There's another opening out to the world, I'm assuming. Okay, where are we? We are... Oh, okay. We are through that little gap there. And here in the area by the... What's the other new name for this? Just waterfalls? Waterfalls biome. So we don't want to come up here just yet, but we'll need to make our way up here eventually. I thought I saw something on the crest of the ridge there, but it was just the edge. Oh wait, there's a green one. Butterfly Neri. Neri? Larva, which is also unique to this biome. All right, uh, where are we? So we will come back up for that sh for sure, but we, we want to be uh, a little systematic about this as previously discussed. Ooh, there's a blue chest. I think once we get a full inventory, we'll head back and uh, go through the teleporter. Where did I? There's the door. Now I'm totally turned around. Um, go through the teleporter, drop off a load of stuff, and then bring the teleporter back here with us. Uh, I think that makes the most sense. That's the cave out to the... that we came back into here. Another blue chest, which might not quite do us in. Handle a few more things. What is the uh, the new other new grub giving us uh, here? Six hundred percent. Okay, so these are the ones we really want to put down. Rare, gotcha. I saw it. I barely saw it, but I saw it. Um, since we know there are golden chests, and also, by the way, um, I think it was Yeti, uh, said that, uh, the, the golden chests were not in the biome we looked at yesterday, so, while, um, that is a fair spoiler, it's not that bad of a spoiler, so, um, we're gonna look for one in here, uh, we should probably look underwater, too, um, we're gonna look for one in here, and we'll look for one by the waterfall someplace, and we'll hope we find them both. But that is, it is in the patch notes. I just missed it. Uh, questionable. Questionable. Clipping. Clipping. I don't want to clip. I want to just explore. I guess I'm going to clip on this side too, yeah. I don't know that I actually put that pod in the center. It might be a little bit off center, but I also didn't know how big this place was, so. Oh, there's more stuff over here to see. Uh, we're gonna come back this way anyway. So let's go back to the pod, get some air, and then head over and do the drop off stuff here. Yeah, this, this pod should have probably been Closer to that big mushroom, not this one, but that's okay. We can move it too. Here we are. We're gonna go towards the red and then toward the teal. And I, the reason I didn't make that one just blue is because of the teleporter being there. I wanted to know where it was, but I think we, if we're moving the teleporter down here, we can just do that. Yeah. Here's the red. There's another meteor shower coming in. And then the teal. Uh, this could just be a regular old meteor storm, though. 
It's going full on grayscale here, isn't it? Beam me out. Okay, so the yellow tint goes full on grayscale in the uh, in that biome. Uh, let's do our drop-off point here. Sort, please. Wow, lots of blueprint chips. Uh, some. Actually, we'll take that with us. Take. You can have this. You can have that. These. These. Those. These. This. Those. That. Keep those. Yeah. Yeah. Over here. Uh, let's actually go ahead and pull this species of butterfly or bee out of here. Nice. And I guess these we just put straight into the thing. We don't just we don't just science these. Hmm. Oh, water. Uh, let's do one of these, and we already have those. Let's do this and the uh, rare. I forgot to dump that seed in there too. This one and that one. Research, please. And start. Uh, we'll put these away for now. Uh, you as well, you as well, you as well, you as well. Let's go dump off that flower. There. And then, uh, yeah, that was just a nothing. Okay. Let's go get some water while we're here, although there should be... Unless we can't drink the pink water. I guess I should try. Uh, I should also take another food packet with me, but I'm not going to eat it yet. Because it, um... They, since they're worth 90, I want to wait until I actually get the ding. Uh, back to the meteor field. And then we can take this up. And we can go toward the red. And then we can decide if we want to move this, uh, this pod. I think we should. Um, we have it over there by that tall mushroom way over there. This looks like it goes this way for a bit, at least. So maybe we move it over to this closer tall mushroom. Arbitrary. But hey, that's what you're here for, right? Right? Pick that up, pick that up. Yeah, over here closer to this entrance, I think. Maybe right in here. Find a good spot for it, like that. Door and beacon... We got here common, common, uncommon. I'll take one more of those. Uh, let's go with uh, yellow here. And then more importantly, the teleporter. There's our food level low warning. I think I'll go down here with it, maybe. Uh, uh, yeah, of course I picked a hilly spot. We'll go down here with it, I guess. Yeah, that's a good spot. And we can name this one... Uh, Mushroom. Whatever. Alright. Uh, common under my feet here. I'm going to wait a little bit more for the food. That was the clippy spot we found. Uh, here should be where the chest is, somewhere near. There it is. Pick the rest of that up. Okay, so we came in through there, and this is just a bit to the... Oh, it isn't actually that much more. Okay. Uh, we still need to find the golden chest, though. Which I suspect is either here with this uh, suspicious-looking technology on a planet that was supposed to have been barren, and where... Although, at least... Yeah, there it is, right there. <laughs> Ooh, new effigy. Ooh, I'll have to look what that one is. That might be a hint as to what we're more of what we're expecting here. Can I drink this? I can't drink this pink water. Okay. Uh, what's up here? Anything? Read message. This underground cave is a blessing for us, the Wardens. There's a lot of resources and it is underground, allowing us to stay hidden from outer space. This planet has been chosen really carefully and now I understand why. I can't wait to start the building of our settlement and fulfill our destiny. A Warden. Oh, the mystery deepens. Mystery Ooh, there's a pink glowy one. All right. Is that a uncommon? We'll take you. And I need air. Crap. Unlock the butterfly display box. Oh, we got to do all that too. Oh, crap. Um, not going to make it. Oh, there's a chest. Okay, uh, air. There we go. All that stuff, please. And this, and we're beaming ourselves back because that was uh, all the things. 
Plus, I need to get another oxygen bottle now. And let's see. Lots of stuff. This. Not that. This. Not those. This. Not those. Not that. This one. Those. Some of these. And box two. This, 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 go. Still haven't uh, gotten the food yet, or needed the food yet, I mean. Uh, what did we get? Amel. Okay. Uh, uncommon, I guess? Didn't get another rare, I don't think, or maybe I did. That's fine. Uh, this goes into here. Uh, that can go in there. This can go in here. I do have another rare. Okay, but I have... I still have one more mutagen and a bunch more uh, fertilizer now. And let's go put down this effigy. Uh, this way, this way. I'll have to build another display case, but I need to do a little bit of cleanup or rearrangement if I'm going to. This is a rocket pack effigy. Uh, unless I just leave it here on the table. It is a rocket pack. Okay, so it's not a hint as to anything, but that's fine too. Uh, food time, I guess. And uh, oxygen. You occasionally get oxygen from these gas extractors. Um, otherwise, you have to make them. Yeah, so there's one here, but the last several times I've been here, it's one here. There has not been any, So, but it's so occasional. But on the other hand, you don't really need it that much because you can get free oxygen just by building a pod. So um, it's only an emergency use item as far as I'm concerned. All right, back here we are... Um, I think I'm good on the pink ones. We have four. We can always come back and get more. But if we see a different kind of glowing one um, or anything, then I will take take advantage of that. So uh, the mystery deepens, though, with the uh, reveal of the wardens here um, as to what or who or something they are. Uh, that was the... Yeah, these are the wrecks we found, the first wrecks we found. Um, exploring underwater is going to be kind of a pain. But... I suppose we can. We found the golden chest. I don't know how many more blue chests there should be here. We found three or four of them. I think four of them. Um, it, I don't think any of the patch notes say how many tr uh, blue chests there are. They could. Oh, there's one right there. Look at that. Speak of the devil. All right. It's good to explore underwater, I guess. But, uh, yeah, I am... Um, I'm a bit uh, awestruck by this uh, biome. It's really cool. I mean, when we saw it yesterday and then I backed my way right back out of it. What are you? Uncommon? I'll take it. I will take it. Um, I just wish it wouldn't produce so many silkworms relative to bees, but on the other hand, we have so many. Uh, you need four of them for the thing, whereas you only need one bee for the honey and two bees for the... whatchamacallit, the uh, farm, that I think it's okay. I haven't really been looking down very well, though. I'm also not sure where I am. That's the other problem with scouting underwater. Oh, I'm here. Okay, I'm here. Uh, so this is where we um, found the golden chest uh, right in here someplace. I see you. Creeper. And I guess that's it for here. Um, we have five blue chests, one golden chest. I don't remember how many blue chests. Did I not finish this one? It just respawned. Free iron. Not that iron isn't basically free anyway. But we're going to take it. Yeah, I think I will not pick up any more pink butterflies, at least for now. Uh, we need oxygen, though. So let's go to... Uh, where's yellow? There it is. Air? There we go. And... That might be it. Uh, this isn't really deep enough to... scout into. We can do it anyway.
And uh, I think we, I think, tentatively think we get everything out of here. But instead of going to the uh, the other new biome today, I think we will do a, uh, we'll do a little bit more of the crafting. We can make the farm. Let's see about uh, putting out some of these other butterflies. Um, we're gonna want to put up a, another butterfly um, uh, dome at some point, if not already. Got some air, I guess. Although I can beam out just as easily. I think that was a common sitting on the ground there. Okay, uh, let's just dump the stuff that I don't need. Uh, you, 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 those, and this, and that too. Must have been in the golden chest. No, that was in the golden chest. I don't know where that came from. Uh, we need to mix. We'll we'll need to make some more mutagen in order to do much more. We got a B. I think I will throw the two uncommons in there and grab out the rare. I'm going to take the two bees with me. Uh, we'll take the fancy butterflies with us. Um, we'll take this and that. Not all those. I control clicked. One of those. And I just did that. Alright, Wally. You're an idiot. There we go. I meant to sort it and instead moved it. Rare. Mutagen. Fertilizer. Go. And then I want definitely want to put one of these in... Oh, the butterflies are creeping out here into the base now. No, those are the bees from outside. Okay. Maybe I should move them away again. Uh, let's put in one of these. Here. And we'll put in this one. Actually, let's look at them first. Yeah, that's, uh, that's pink. That's like, um... And those are awesome as well. Uh, that pink is like pulsar quartz pink. All right, let's put one of those back in here uh, and then we'll build some more butterfly thingies. Uh, but let's build the farm first. Water bottle I have, fertilizer, fertilizer tier two and super alloy. All right, uh, here. Um, I also have water bottles in here. So I'll take an extra one. Super alloy was down here. Uh, overflow here. One or two? One. So I see one of the black fertilizers, too, which is in the box over here that I'm using. For the bugs. I don't know if I showed you that or not. Bugs. Uh, is this an indoor thing or an outdoor thing? I think it's an outdoor thing, right? Yeah, definitely an outdoor thing. It's huge. Uh, this should be what probably what goes here. I should probably move those. And then I think it says put a put a, a farming on Mars achievement unlocked. I think it says put a put a seed in here, uh, a food seed in here. Let's uh, let's take take these here. Sad that these only leave one though, but I guess they come fast enough that it doesn't matter. I'm gonna put them here in this uh, in amongst these flowers. And I should have held control down, but I didn't. Oh, oh there is pulsar quartz there. I thought that was bee butterflies. Um, actually, in fact, I want to change that anyway. So let's take these out and put one of these Futuras in here because they're better. And there's more Pulsar Quartz. There is more Pulsar Quartz. Look at all this. Rare. Got you. Got you. Got you. Hmm. There's one. Yeah, these look like they're made of pulsar quartz, though. Maybe they are. Maybe they are. Maybe I should try mining in that new biome as well. Because uh, it might give us something interesting. Okay, so we need to go get a vegetable seed. Um, I think we'll do... I don't know. I think we'll do beans. Uh, which, which one of these is beans? There we are. Beans! You go in here. Okay. And I guess it just takes one, which is kind of a bummer. Because we could really 
handle it providing a bit more rare I'm gonna leave the uncommon on the ground but I'm taking the rares we got a lot of uncommons now so that'll be fine and there's some in here too okay that's hilarious all right, so we need to build some more butterfly uh, things now. Um, butterfly farms. Fertilizer tier two, zeolite and bioplastic nugget. That I don't have very much of, uh, the fertilizer tier two. And those are fairly complicated to make. We have one here though. Um, put one of these in there. Uh, we have one here and put the rest of those in there. Uh, zeolite and bioplastic nuggets. Zeolite and bioplastic nuggets. To make some more of these two. Those are uh, made from the mushrooms and something else. Uh, the butterfly domes, farms, thingies. Let's just put more of them here in these closer flowers because I'm kind of getting lazy. Uh, I guess I should put down all the Futuras though. Because, well, they're going to give us more insect score. And that's the thing we want. Plus, having three of the same butterflies here in this. Uh, thing kind of makes some sense, I guess. Plus the bees. Makes some sense. So... How long does it take this to grow? And what do I see when it's done? Does it say? Growth 0%. Instead of vegetable seed in it to grow multiple vegetables. Okay, so it does grow more than one from the seed, but it's still at 0% growth. Why is it at 0% growth? Huh. I mean, I did put it in the shade underneath the building here, but I don't think that makes a difference. I guess it could, though. We'll wait and see. Uh, let's see. So we have more rares. I'm going to have to work on those off camera, probably. Um, we'll put these... Oh, I had another bee. I can put down another beehive then. Put those in there for now. Um, I can take a couple of these out for now and make some more uh, food. And then drop the... Drop the whole supply in here. Uh, let's grab the stuff we need for a miner, though, and um, see if we can uh, miner tier two. See if we can mine anything in that other biome before we call this a day. There's the butterfly display box. So we definitely need to keep one of each kind for that purpose. Um, miner tier two, three osmium, one super alloy rod, two iridium rod. Iridium, two rod. Uh, super alloy, the rods I put in here, and I had a bunch. Uh, and then osmium, I think it was three of them. I actually have too much osmium now. Um, so I swapped out a name, a named container for another name. Uh, we don't need to drink before we go because we're going into a place with a bunch of water. All right. And then uh, let's see about a miner somewhere in here. Come on. do it that way oh well then just iron though so uh one more project before we leave today power's back on and that project is to build another fusion reactor uh, those take five pulsar quartz and four super alloy maybe we can build two of them Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Wow, we got a lot of super alloy rods now. Eight. What am I? Water? Yeah, that's fine. Uh, here. Nine, ten, right? And then eight super alloy. Bingo. Another storm incoming. Alright. 
We couldn't put any here because they were clipping, I think. Is that the deal? No, they're not clipping anymore. Okay, so they must have fixed that. Uh, let's see. They rotate to look like this, though. Maybe that's a good idea. Yeah. And then, like this. For reasons, TM. That'll be a little bit more power now. Another 1485 times 2, so that's almost uh, 3,000. More. Incoming. I hear it. I think I hear it. I sure the drill. Never mind. This is not a drill, but actually it is. Oh, those butterflies glowing weird, weirded me out over there. That is awesome. All right. Uh, so let's see. Um, map screen says, yeah, nothing incoming. Alrighty, so I think what we're going to do is leave this here. Um, and in the next episode, we'll take a look at the uh, at the uh, waterfall. And um, also, I will hopefully have some more butterflies to unlock uh, with some more mutagen and uh, fertilizer made. So thank you all for joining me, and I will see you then. Bye for now.